Yeah. What's up? What's up, guys? Welcome back to N N Rocks. And welcome back to N N Rocks. Let's say it again. Feet. I heard the special boomer. Feet. Yeah, Max plays. So yeah, Max plays. Yes. So today we are going to make you guys a amazing video. The name of the video is Camp Survival. So, anyways, we have a few questions. Yes. <coughs> How many days are we, are we going to be in the camp survival? This camp survival is not for days, but only for hours. We will do it. We'll pretend like there's like day one, day two, like yeah, some, that's something like that. So basically, for day five till five days. So we will pretend like there's like mobs We're around the house. We're pretending this uh, uh, this because we want like if you guys are like want to do something virtual camp right at home then you can do all the stuff so we're doing how to do this virtual camp survival yeah so i had like virtual camp like a few days ago yeah so that's so, why we look here so we want you to we want to prepare you we want to prepare you for a virtual camp because you guys, you know, you can't go for treks at this pandemic. You can't right? just go, go like to your bed. Like, say you're in virtual camp, you have to like stay far from your bed. Yeah, stay far from your bed. So guys. you, so at nighttime, you have to sleep in your den. Yeah, you, you can't just go like, ooh, I'm gonna go sleep now so in my bed. We're going to just tell you guys how to do this virtual camp right at home because we want you guys to have fun. Right here? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So my virtual camp was just like for like a one Yeah, night. we got actually an idea from his virtual camp because we thought that why don't we make a virtual camp ritual? How to make it, how to be in it so that you guys can be trained how to be and have fun in a virtual camp right at home instead of just going to treks right now because it's not a good weather, it's not a good season to go right now to treks. So that's why to like camping. So that's why you can do this virtual camp right at home and we guys will tr train, no, we, us, we, us, blah, 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 we, us, we both are going to train all of you guys how to do this virtual camp so that you guys can be trained how to do the virtual camp and have fun right at home instead of doing like anything. And guys, please watch our previous video over there. We have given you five fun activities you mean four because we didn't do the fifth one yes four because the mystery one will come in part two so four which is tomorrow morning yes or so evening four yes so four of them four activities so check out check those four activities uh, that we have done in our previous video you can check that out so that you can kind of know some other type of activities you can do right at home during this pandemic so let's just get started and let's get amazed up okay so you know so like they're like uh, so what you need? You need your den. Obviously, you will need a den. Yes, but if you guys do not worry, if you don't have a den, you can just like build, build one. It. No, not if you build one. Take all type of mats and everything, and you can stay in a room as it could be a den for you. But inside the room, you will have your room, your mat and everything you need to put inside your den. Just make a den. Yeah, well, you can do a tutorial. I have yeah. learned a tutorial on how to make a tent. Yeah, so guys, Your please check tent? out. Yeah, please check out Gamer X Plays how to make like his video of how to make a tent tent tutorial during a virtual camp. So it's really easy. He will upload the video, right? Yeah. So you can check out from there. But but if you do not want to make the tent, you can do the idea as a tool. Go in somebody else's room and just make all the stuff you need to put in your tent. Just make a carpet. You can do that. Okay. If you don't want so to make it. let's start. First of all, we need to build the den. So what so, you need is a blankie, like a blanket. Mm -hmm. So you need like a pillow because you're gonna sleep on the floor. Yeah. So we need and a mattress a and like um like something like we to have keep a your mattress right there. We'll just show it to you guys. So so anyways, so here is the mattress. We will need a adult for this, but we're not gonna use the mattress. We're gonna use a carpet, which is in our drawing room. Yeah. So what we could do is we can, so first what we can do. So like get like some chairs. You know like the chairs like we have so many type of stools we can use to put inside our den like a big chair then you put it on your <coughs> then if, yeah as you know that like tents are really small so there's small like a small type of mini 
house. That, that's why we cannot cook. But big chairs, like this big chair. Here, I'll just show it to you guys. Here. You cannot let me just this big chair. Let me just help you. Yes, you cannot let go. this big chair. So, no, move up. Uh, don't worry, let me do it. No, it's okay. I'll just put it down. So, you can, we cannot put like, those big chairs because we need our head to like... We straight because we do like this, you know, it can give you a neck pain. So, that like, you need like big chairs? No, no, you don't need big chairs, dude. Not big chairs, you need small stools where you can sit on so that your hair, your head does not go like this. So, say, push. like, the roof is here. Like, in your well, yeah, if the roof is thing. here and the stools are like really low, then you can sit like this and then the, it'll not touch the your head will not touch the roof and but then you will have you, to do this like for like a, more than one hour or something yeah and that's why but if you use these big and if the roof is here and then the stool is here the, the big chair is here as i showed you no need to help neil do not need a so guys i give you a solution try cl crossing your legs inside it will be like more like Suitable. Yeah, so if you use that type of chair I just showed you right now, you then you your head will have to like touch the roof. Like I'm sitting here and it, it just touched the roof. No. Or maybe if if it was the size of her nose, some like to the bottom of her nose. Yeah, and then I will go up and I won't be able to like I will have to bend down, which will hurt me, right? So, so then what she could do is cross her legs. So anyways, then building. On my video, we'll show how to do the dangle. Yes. So let's just get started with our stuff. So come on, I'll take you guys to the adventure of the den. Okay, we're, so we're not actually gonna build a den, but we're just gonna make like everything what is inside okay. the den. Okay. So um, I I'll, I'll just do the video. I'm not gonna put it on my channel. Can you hold this, please. Sure. I'll hold the camera if you want. Hold the camera for me, please. Everybody, come on, come on, follow me. Follow me. Guys, we're going to use two pillows because we need two pillows. And there are two people. Where shall we enter? That side, man. That side will be okay, but Yeah, because that's the living room. The living room which has a carpet. So here we have our two pillows. We have two pillows here. Hi, Mama. So here we have two pillows. And now we're going to bring some snacks. No, no, no. That's two. We'll... Children's first aid kit. Yes. As, yeah, as you guys remember. Do you guys remember this? Yes. yes right? This was on one of her previous videos. Yes, please. And then blocks. I made it by myself. So guys, please check out the previous video of how did I make how I made this children first aid kit, which contains everything a children needs in case he or she gets hurt. So we so, this So you'll need first. like some two pillows. Some chairs. You need the first aid kit, which is right here. Let's go get some snacks. So, so like that you'd have like some healthy snacks instead healthy of like snacks. instead of like junk food. Let's see. We can get so like for breakfast, we could have like some oatmeal. Show the camera. Duh. So, so here is our. What do you think we can get from here? Anything? So Anything? should we get this? Should we get some soda? Should we get... I think we will need... We will Should we get this or... Or something healthier? I think we This is not very healthy. I think we should just get this because this will be the energy drink. But rest all stuff, we'll keep it healthy. Because this is the only thing we can... Like, this get. is a Coke. But yeah. that's not healthy. But this still counts as like a protein drink. Yes, it's a protein drink. So you guys can just... It still counts. It's but optional. You, you only should have little amounts. sure we are we will be like responsible of holding the other type of cups like the glass cups like these ones here we are going to use the plastic cups, like plastic bottles or anything yeah so and we will need like some some like uh, oh yeah i think i have some amazing stuff we can have so here is but actually even though they're junk let's see hmm pretty junk it smells oh, nice, nice though. Um, hmm. There's nothing here we can have healthy. I think we should check. I think we should have some, some milk. Because that's vitamin D. 
wheat and mix it into our coffee. But the thing is, we cannot take milk for a trek because, you know, it'll get really warm because it's really hot outside in treks. We cannot have anything from the freezer because we'll not be able to get some barbecue and stuff from there. But we can, we do have a Do you guys food. think that cheese slices will, uh, will be good enough for us to eat? Yes, Please it comment could. Down below. It could be, so we'll take that as well. Yeah, so here we have the cheese slices, but we're going to take them a little later. So first we're going to make a list because it's good to make lists during camping and everything. So basically you can just make some... So you're supposed to make a list of what things you need, the equipment you need, so like snacks, water, beverages, different types of beverages. So over here we can so that we will be settled and then in case we have nothing then we can just take it from the forest, right? So hi mom, we are teaching everyone how to do a workshop camp. Yes. So you can like get some soup, like some tomato soup. Then, uh, like, you can make a fire and then, like, you can, like, hang it, the soup. But, guys, please be careful because of adult supervision. If you want to make some fire for your camp, please ask a adult to help you because you do not want to burn your fingers. Right? Or the house. Yes, or the house because that will be not good for your house because there are a lot of people and it'll it'll cause us disease for our lungs and it can cause cancer. So right? in the next video we will do like the camp survival like um like so right the days. Now, yeah, so this, this is this called is the preparation. This is called the the, pe the preparation of our virtual camp. So let's just go and get some stuff. And we need activities to do. So we have some activities in our first day kit. There are some mittens and stuff we can draw, and as you can see, sketch pens, mittens, bells, paper that floats. This, this is the bell I colored earlier today. Yes, so here, and those are the sketch pens, and here are some bandages if you guys need. And we are going to share share equipment together because they say not to waste equipment we're gonna take half of the soda and share it together they say not to waste equipment so we need only one cola for this trip so so we will uh, we will need some water as well what about water yes water because that this will make us sick yes because so come with us come on come, come let's get a bottle of water can you hold this can you hold this so we should get water. Wait, water. Look at, look at so, as you know, that you cannot have enough ingredients to wash up your hands. So okay. you'll need some sanitizer. Yeah, there'll be a lot of germs if you touch sand and glass. So that's why we should bring hand sanitizer. This is a part of the first aid kit. So this is just the preparation of how we're going to settle it up. So here we will take the sanitizer in the middle in case you need it anytime else. Okay. So, anyways. Come on with me, come with me. So water should be, okay. Kids who are watching this, kids and adults, who are doing this camp, kids. So here, this we is have an these important mini water measure. bottles. We have these mini water bottles. We're gonna fill them up with water. Here I have some water. Okay, so right now, Naharika, I have an important message to tell all our viewers. So viewers, kids who are watching this, what you have to do is take some water with you on your camp because if you don't have water you'll be dehydrated if not then then you will you'll pass away that will, that won't be good you'll be dehydrated and like so thirsty you won't you'll no, be you dying be to like, thirst no, yeah you'll be dying for thirst and then you like no that. the pass the pass away joke was just a joke but seriously, that's sad. So, anyways, let's so continue. Here we have a bottle of water. We need many of these. Yes. So one for like one. We'll take like every bottle for. And here we have a bigger bottle in case that equipment is over. We will do take not this take. Uh, do not take glass bottles. Like you know <gasps> the. Do you know those Vos bottles? Like some oh of the. Oh my God! Glass? Just hold it like this. So, yes. anyways, you know the Vos bottles, like which are glass. Yes. No. Those are not required. Yes, because you you will not like sometimes there are people who can who will uh, we will not be able to take care of these like during virtual camp. So, so that's why we're taking this little so, yeah. plastic. Wait, 
So we, we have this little plastic little bottle. We're gonna use this. So we're gonna use this only for home and we'll use that for going to camps because we're not sure where we can leave okay. this precious bottle. So now, Naharika will take over and I'll just be back. So yes guys, here it is. Yay, so nice. It's a really good bottle. I filled it with water already. Yeah. So I'm gonna keep it right here next to the South Korea little type of plastic bottle. But here we have, we will not use these equipments. No using these equipments. These are steel, so we are only gonna get plastic. And as I'm telling you, no using knives. If only using knives, only use a butter knife because we're gonna use that to cut stuff. Water, check. Mm, then let's see. Equipment, check for type of eating. Then and food, the food and snacks, we cannot see, we cannot see anything. Like we can't have anything unhealthy. Like yeah, so it's like you don't have anything else unhealthy. So I will teach you guys how to make this amazing coffee. It's a little healthy. It's a little bit sugary, but it'll be really yummy to make. Unhealthy. Yeah, a little healthy. Not that much, but it's okay. But do not. You can take this to me. You can take this to camps or anything if you do. Uh, if you want anything, any other type of beverages or water. Hold it. Yeah. So we we'll need this, and then what next do we need? We will not have too much uh, fat. Yeah, no fattening. Where are you? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. So. So, unhealthy stuff is so not allowed. Not allowed, but it's optional for you guys. However, if you guys want it to be, you can take sugary stuff or any type of stuff you guys want. So over here we have sugar, we have coffee powder, we need some coffee, we need coffee also, but we do not have that, so I'm going to tell you the recipe. So we will need this milk powder, sugar, coffee powder, and some cocoa butter. Then take a glass and put, yeah, and milk. So then take a glass, that, uh, or uh, uh, yeah, sorry, a bottle. Take a bottle and then put some milk in it. Then in the milk, put your coffee powder. After that, put the sugar. I'm using normal sugar. If you guys want, you can use diet sugar too. Then we need sugar and then add some coffee made. Then add some cocoa powder. Then give it. Then take the bottle and close it, and then give it a good shaky, shaky shake. Then that, then you'll get amazing brown mixture. Then put it into another bottle if you want, or you can use the same bottle and take it to your camp. And it'll be really super duper yummy, right? It's amazing. Yeah. So okay. let's just get started with our camp nest. Okay. So, what do you want to now? What, what we have, but we're actually still not ready for our nutrients. We need some foods, you know. Yes, actually, okay. So, can you guys guess the mystery that we need for our virtual camp? Please comment down below. Actually, he already told us it's called food. Yeah, I have to tell it because that's what we were missing. Yeah, so what would you like to have to eat, Neil? We would have like some healthy protein, not like some fats. So this is how the camp will look like when you reach there, something like this. It will have flowers and plants. That's just for normal at her house. This is just an example. Like, yeah. But in the real camp, there will be like bushes and the flowers and trees yes but still what can we use something mm -hmm. for healthy we could have fruits but we do not have enough equipment for fruits because we're out of fruits but you guys if you guys have fruits you guys can also have them they're yummy 
fruit, fruit salad. You can make fruit salad too. Right, Leo? So for breakfast, you could, what could we have for breakfast, lunch, and dinner if we were on a camp for five days? Pretty good question. I think I have enough. So say, guys, you had to go like on a camp. Like, we're not going to do five days. We're just going to do like what, how to do it on one night. Yeah. Because so, camps are usually like for one, one night. So basically, let's see. Oh, we have some enough juice equipment. As you see here, we just put this juice equipment. My mom yesterday made this yummy juice and we put it in an AMT recycle bottle. It's a really nice orange juice. But it's really here fruit cocktail. It is because we use the empty, empty recycle bottle to put this in the fridge. So this is orange juice and we can use orange juice as healthy, fresh homemade made orange juice with no sugars and no fats right Neil yeah okay so now we all need okay stop with the unhealthy stuff too much this we, is not unhealthy this is healthy I know this is just an example so no for, so for example I'm gonna use this because this is healthy my mom made this for me for it's super healthy it with no for sugar. example for example this is an unhealthy thing no, we don't want that. We want For something else. Sure that was just a plate. Yeah, that's just an example. So, we will need something healthy because it's good for us, our health. Yes. But actually, you know, the, you know we should take a little junk food, no junk food actually, a little bit because, you know, the, the, in the forest, when you guys go there, there will be a lot of fruits and vegetables you can cook and you can water them and then you can have them for dinner, for lunch, and for different types of Okay, breakfast. so for dinner, I, would, I know what we could have for dinner. We could have like some tomato soup. But if you want to make tomato soup, you'll need tomatoes, but we don't have that. So you guys can check out, and this is a fun activity. You can go with your parents out to the camp, to the jungle, with your parents, not alone. You can go there and then find some amazing type of vegetables and fruit you can have to eat for breakfast or for lunch or for dinner. You can go, so then, like for breakfast, mm -hmm. for breakfast, you could have, I don't know what's for breakfast, but for what? breakfast, I think I know. For breakfast, we can make some food, uh, not food, fruit salad. You can just take all types of different varieties of fruits you have, cut them and cut them into small pieces and then put them into a small bowl and eat it and have a yummy breakfast. And for lunch, we can have some, um, yeah, we can have some vegetables, we can have some, um, cauliflower with ladyfinger and mix them amazing it's called fried cauliflower and ladyfinger i made it once and the last for dinner we can have some tomato soup yeah because that's okay. like so usually like you know like in camp videos like you know like some people like they like um, in cartoons they like go like for like camping and then they have like dinner this is just an example this is the soup for example yeah this is the juice food uh, food, the soup, and then there's the fire, like the campfire, like your father or mother lit. Mm -hmm. Then, like it's then. So, so a warning: Do not eat the a raw tomato soup. Yes, guys, please wash the tomato. Yes. 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 So you should take like an extra, like extra bottle, so like you can wash your fruits. Oh, that's pretty well. So, I think this is enough for our video today, and I'll meet you with on the survival. Yes, on the camp survival, and we'll see you next time. So, let's give it a ta-ta, and see you next time. Bye!